From scratch, C12. Where are we? Right here, right here. So it's right here. Where and we then... are here. So we need to go to level two. It's on level two. Okay. Oh, awesome. Look, 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 look. Yeah, we found him. Sure. You and the fountain. You are your daddy's child. <laughs> Horrible movie. You found barnyard? I did find barnyard. Oh, mommy found barnyard. Okay. I found it. Here's the pee. Where's the rest of it? I see it. I see it. See? Okay. Bacon. Chili for breakfast. Oh, I have food. I have been to have food. Yours looks insane. And then... Mommy's French toast.
off day, quote unquote. Um, I'm going to unbox this here because I'm so excited about it. Oh my God, where is the opening? Oh shoot, it's an easy, I gotta undo the sides. Ooh, I'm gonna pull it up somehow with one hand. It could not be done with one hand, so here I am. <laughs> Ooh, you know what? Ooh, it's, it's lilac or lavender, whichever color you want to call it. It's beautiful and it's very light compared to a Le Creuset or a Stobe. Super light. Mmm, that's a good size. It's four quarts. I was actually considering a 4.7 quart Le Creuset. Um, I guess that's not ruled out per se. Uh, I might still want it, but um, this is great. It's great. I'm supposed to cut something open. I don't remember which one. Oh, I think I'm supposed to cut this open. I'm supposed to cut that this open. How do I do it? Like this? Ooh, that's sharp. I mean, that's... In the diagram that uh, that's that's in the manual, it says to use this. So I hope I don't cut myself. Easy for you to say, and it's using a much less like industrial-looking knife um, box cutter too. I can't do it. That means there's no drain hole though. Update. I'm not able to cut the drain hole over here at all. I'm not able to cut the drain hole over here at all. I tried to cut a drain hole here, and also no bueno. I don't know if it's just, I don't know. And I just realized, even if I did cut this out, if I cut it up to here, like what's the point? Because the water is never gonna be that high up, I don't think. That's a lot of water that I'm putting in there. I'm gonna do potting soil on that, and then some seed starters. My husband's gonna kill me. I'm making a huge mess out of his like work table. And then I'm gonna put some seed starter stuff on top. I don't know what I'm doing, so don't laugh at me if you're like an expert seed grower. I've never done this before. It's my first time. Just wanna make some herbs. Ow! Did I get a oh I got a splinter? Hold on. I have dill, I have cilantro, and I have parsley. These are the first three I'm gonna start out with. I have other herbs that I bought as well, but um, some of them need to grow on their own, and I also just wanna see if I'm even able to do this. So I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do cilantro, dill in the middle, and then parsley so that I can kind of tell the difference between these two because they kind of look kind of similar. So cilantro, I'm gonna do this so that I can remember too. Oh, planting depth. It does say it. It's a quarter inch. Okay. Let's make some room over here. Two. I mean, the more the merrier, right? No? Can you go here? Near my window? I've got some shade. This is what I use for my monster. <laughs> okay, that's that. Wish me luck. He's eating some pollen from the flowers. Job. Just playing with uh, people's discarded chalk here. I don't know who Eleni is, but I hope your heart's doing better. I'm gonna be making pork and chive dumplings today. I'm gonna take out a portion for my daughter because I don't think 
I don't think she's gonna like chives, so I'll just take out a little portion for her and make it just a pork, just a pure pork um, dumpling. her portion and then I'm gonna chop up some chives and dump it in there and continue with that. <laughs> okay this part I'm just gonna wait because I don't know, I don't yeah. know exactly. Yeah. So I'm gonna make it like I'm making like wonton filling. Oh, my lucky cat no, oh it's for the store? Definitely gonna need some white pepper. Oh, okay. it's the Lexus dealership today um, the mic on my car stopped working so I need to get it serviced so here I am have my coffee in hand I have my work laptop and um, they're gonna fix the transceiver if I'm saying it right so they can't find my appointment <laughs> oh boy for sure we booked it though it's on text message so hopefully they uh, rectify this I mean, it is. If anybody's looking for a new Lexus, these are the new models. Looks like a good seat. Work okay. laptop. Your pods. I think I'm set. Stay here for two hours. We'll get some new cars while we're here. So this black one is basically what my car is. And then there's these ones. 
And then there's also the big version, the RXs. These are nice too. Oh, but I still love my car the most. The black. Look how sexy it is. I'm finally done. It's like past noon already. I'm gonna go to the cashier and check out all the cereal spilled. I feel like dumped it back here. I'm gonna clean this up. Oh. Day of running errands. Now I'm at Stonestown returning something. Life pro tip. Men's section has a shorter line for returns. Aha! Short, short lines, short, short lines. I came home and dumped some avocado in my um, pokey and it's so good. The um, the scallops are so good. I love getting scallop. Mm. Also, I have a side of my bean curd rolls that I made yesterday using my husband's aunt's recipe. They're so good if you like bean curd. Going to debut my three and a half quart Love Crusade brazier today. I'm gonna make sukiyaki tonight. Udon. Coffee tofu, of course, or you can use just regular tofu. I think you're supposed to use regular actually, but I wanted the fried stuff, so. Beef, of course. I got some shabu beef. Inoki. Shiitake. And a big nappy cabbage, which I'm gonna cut into smaller pieces. Huge. Oh! What lovely mushrooms they are. Well, now I know that mushroom doesn't last forever. Well, I mean, they lasted a little bit less than forever though. Come on. Okay, I don't know what I'm doing here. Just see it online and it looks really pretty when people do this. Oh, that's kind of ugly. <laughs> oh, cut that one too deep. Oops. Important item of all, sukiyaki sauce. Why are my mushrooms so ugly? So I got these uh, Noda Horo. Um, what do you call these containers? Because it actually comes with a lid. Um, and I got this and another size. Wait, I got this and two other sizes, I should say. Um, and they're actually really great and super aesthetic. I highly recommend it. It's kind of pricey, but they're great for storage if you need it uh, for that reason, or um, for prepping, uh, for cooking. Um, they're just really nice, but you know what I use it for? Give me a second, I'll, I'll show you what I use this for, this size anyway. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Well, I mean, it's not the main purpose of this um, tray, but I've uh, I've been using it to put my coffee on it when I um, transport it back upstairs because I have this, um, I don't know what, what you call it. It's, uh, I have this issue where I have to fill my coffee to the brim and it usually leaks. So this is my solution to that. Okay, maybe not filming and moving at the same time with this super full coffee. Okay, see you later.